Well, hey, handy people, Dan here. Hey, um, I want to talk to you about this little beauty right here. I've had it for a while, and I've been remiss. Of course, my daughter works a lot, and she's busy, and I don't get to see her a lot, so I got to wait till she comes by. But let me show you this little beauty we call Betty. So come on. Now, Betty is a 2000 V70R, and uh, she's in beautiful shape. She's got, I think, uh, about 180,000 on the motor. Um, she's all black. She's got the Dolby dash, and she has the two-tone uh, seats, which are really pretty. She's in real nice shape. I mean... Overall, now my daughter uses it, as you can tell. Um, got the 16-inch satellites in silver with nice Continental tires. Uh, a little bit of rust on that rear um, window. And I do have another um, tailgate for it. And, uh, yeah, this is just a nice car. I'll pop the hood next, but it, you know, came as a uh, with no roof rails and uh, with a spoiler. Now, when I bought it, uh, the engine was blown, um, had blown head gasket because it overheated. So I called on a good friend of mine, Will Fry, and I said, "Will, you want to do a project for me?" Because I was knee deep in projects, and he agreed. So let me show you what Will did. Start out by saying uh, this fender was damaged when the bumper got damaged, but uh, we'll change that for me. And uh, yeah, that was one of the one of the things that Will did. He also uh, got me a cross country grill for the front, which is real nice. And he did. He put a a, a two thousand uh, high pressure turbo two point three in place of the 2.4 that was originally native to the car it was an engine I'd pulled from a c70 and uh, that was a high performance car and had in my stock and it's got about 160,000 if I remember correctly but we put the green injectors and uh, the 19t on it and uh, just basically everything is stock this is just a stock beautiful car but will uh, stage zeroed the motor he did a ton of work and did a good job. I mean, the car runs and drives beautifully, so can't complain. One of the reasons I bought this with a bad motor is because it had been, uh, had a, the five-speed auto was replaced with a factory reman unit um, about 20,000 miles ago. So the, the factory five-speed automatic is in this car and runs beautifully. So this is a really nice stock 2000 V70R, which is, you know, that's no joke. The motor was native, horsepower was something like 260. And um, I'm sure with the way it's sitting with this 2.3, with all the, the 19T and greens and the same tune, no, no extra tunes, no changes there, um, it runs really well. Uh, currently the drive shaft's out of it for the summer, but I have the drive shaft and angle gear. And um, yeah, the car is a complete all wheel drive unit. It's a beauty and I love the tint on this car. It's really nice. So there you have it, Betty. Oh yeah. I really, really like this car and I'm grateful to Will. If you ever need anything done, he's a good guy to get a hold of because uh, you know, he did me a solid with building this baby. And I've probably forgotten some things because it was actually last summer but uh or the 
almost a year ago now. But um, this one is, um, it's probably got the best paint of all my Volvos, or, or at least second best. It's a really nice car. So glad it's part of our fleet. My daughter drives it daily, um, and it's been reliable. She's gone on several trips, and, you know, never a problem. Oh, yeah.